Our hymn is number 191 in the Lumen Christi hymnal, number 191. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, (coughs) and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. O Jesus, you unsanctified, a vast of forty days complete to give us courage to perform the penance fallen nature needs. Be present to your church that mourns with sorrow over past excess and tries to make my fervent prayer Adornment for the sins of men. By your great mercies, love and grace, forgive our straying in the past. O sinless Christ against all sin, in future keep us on our guard. That purified by Lent and fast, and abnegation of our wills, we may prepare to celebrate the Paschal joys of prison life. Let all creation worship you, O blessed forgiving Trinity. And we, by pardon born anew, shall sing a new song to the Lord. Amen. I guarded them, and not one of them is lost. I lift up my eyes to the mountains, from where shall come my help? My help shall come from the Lord, who made heaven and earth. May he never allow you to stumble, let him sleep not your God. No, he sleeps not nor slumbers. Israel's God. The Lord is your God and your shade. At your right side he stands. By day the sun shall not smite you, nor the moon in the night. The Lord will guard you from evil. He will guard your soul. The Lord will guard your going and coming, both now and forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. I guarded them, and not one of them is lost. Humble yourselves before the Lord, and he will exalt you. To you I have lifted up my eyes, you who dwell in the heavens. My eye is like the eyes of slaves on the hand of their lords. 
like the eyes of a servant on the hand of her mistress. So our eyes are on the Lord our God till he show us his mercy. Have mercy on us, Lord, have mercy. We are filled with contempt. Indeed, all too full is our soul with the scorn of the rich, with the proud man's disdain. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Humble yourselves before the Lord, and He will exalt you. From his presence, earth and sky fled away. God is for us a refuge and strength, a helper close at hand in time of distress. So we shall not fear, though the earth should rock, though the mountains fall into the depths of the sea, even though its waters rage and foam. Even though the mountains be shaken by its waves, the Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our stronghold. The waters of a river give joy to God's city, the holy place where the Most High dwells. God is within, it cannot be shaken. God will help it at the dawning of the day. Nations are in tumult, kingdoms are shaken. He lifts his voice, the earth shrinks away. The Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our stronghold. Come, consider the works of the Lord, the redoubtable deeds he has done on the earth. He puts an end to wars over all the earth. The bow he breaks, the spear he snaps. He burns the shields with fire. Be still and know that I am God, supreme among the nations, supreme on the earth. The Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our stronghold. Glory to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. From His presence, earth and sky fled away. We give thanks to you, Lord God Almighty. We praise you, the Lord God Almighty, who is and who was. You have assumed your great power. You have begun your reign. The nations have raged in anger, but then came your day of wrath and the moment to judge the dead. The time to reward your servants, the prophets, and the holy ones who revere you, the great and the small alike. Now of salvation and power come, the reign of our God and the authority of his anointed one. For the accuser of our brothers is cast out, who night and day accuse them before God. They defeated him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of their testimony. Love for life did not deter them from death. So rejoice, you heavens, and you that dwell therein. 
Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. We give thanks to you, Lord God Almighty. From a letter of St. James. Submit to God, resist the devil, and he will take flight. Draw close to God, and he will draw close to you. Cleanse your hands, you sinners. Purify your hearts, you backsliders. Begin to lament, to mourn, and to weep. Let your laughter be turned into mourning, and your joy into sorrow. Be humbled in the sight of the Lord and he will raise you on high. Mode 8. Yeah. 
Christ the Lord gave us a new commandment of love for each other. Let us pray to him. Good Master, teach us to love you and our neighbor, and in serving them to serve you. On the cross, you ask pardon for your executioners. Give us strength to love our enemies and to pray for those who persecute us. Through the mystery of your body and blood, deepen our love, our perseverance, and our trust. Strengthen the weak, console the sorrowful, and give hope to the dying. Light of the world, you gave light to the man born blind when he had washed in the pool of Siloam. Enlighten catechumens through the water of baptism and the word of life. Pray for Father Nathan, Father John Trez, for all those who ask for our prayers especially for Scott, for Mauricio, for Father Sam. Give to the dead the perfect joy of your eternal love and number us also among your chosen ones. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Let us pray. Bestow on us, we pray, O Lord, a spirit of always pondering on what is right and of hastening to carry it out. And since without you we cannot exist, may we be enabled to live according to your will. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. May the divine assistance be always with us. And also with our brothers and sisters. Martyrology of March 6th. At Ghent in Flanders, around 1447, St. Colette, or Nicolette, Virgin. A third order Franciscan, she initially lived an eremitical life near the church of Corby, her hometown. Afterwards, she worked to revive the love and practice of evangelical poverty and the poor Clare order of which she eventually became the Abbess General. Also, the heavenly birth of numerous other saints whose names are inscribed in the Book of Life. 